Hey, gasolina. Si hay, si hay. It's the perfect antidote to soaring prices at the pumps. Dirt cheap Venezuelan gasoline smuggled over the border into Colombia and sold at cut price. Well, technically it is illegal to buy the Venezuelan gas, but if you can't find good quality Colombian gasoline, then I'd say it's more like a legal vacuum. It's a bad thing, but everybody does it, this driver says. Colombian Victor Valencia says he was studying to be a Catholic priest, but switched to selling contraband gas to help feed his mother and brothers. It's illegal. It's illegal, but everything here is illegal unless you've got a permit. I'm just trying to support my family, and it's a risky job, he says. Sold legally at the pumps in Colombia, a gallon of gas costs between $3 and $3.50. If you buy it from the smugglers, served up at roadside out of a plastic can, it's half the price just over a dollar fifty. Those Venezuelans have got a lot of gas and it's good quality, this smuggler says. It's an anarchic and porous frontier. Gas smuggling is so rampant that Colombian customs officials at a checkpoint just yards away seem to turn a blind eye. They decline to comment on camera. Watching over it all, the money changes trading wads of currency at black market rates, which means it's cheaper than ever for Colombians to shop in Venezuela. The gas smuggling chain starts a few hundred yards away across the border. At official exchange rates, a gallon of gasoline in Venezuela will cost you 14 cents. If you change your cash on the black market, that same gallon will cost you just seven cents. That means you can fill up an average family-sized car for the price of this bottle of Coca-Cola. With a tank full of gas for just 70 cents, Venezuelans drive into Colombia, where Valencia and other gas bootleggers siphon it out. In Colombia, they get 10 times what they paid in Venezuela, but if they're caught, the drivers said they faced heavy fines and confiscation of their vehicles. Regardless of the risk, with world oil prices hitting record highs, gas smuggling may be too profitable to stop. This is a frontier and wherever there's a frontier, there's smuggling. They'll never wipe that out, this driver says. So for now, the dream of cheap gas seems set to last, a dream that comes in a dirty plastic can. Carl Penhall, CNN, on the Colombian-Venezuelan border.